in the last episode of Cautious Hero. <laughs> no respect! Oh, shit. Very well. I will let you teach me. Oh, can you teach me how to? <laughs> oh, shit. Dude, best girl. <laughs> You motherfucker! Yo, what is going on, my husbandos and my foods? My name is Hermzar. Welcome to another live reaction review of Cautious Hero. If you guys are excited, make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like for me because that would help me a lot. Subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell, my boys. I realized when I was watching my Cautious Hero live reactions, I would say like more than 69% of it is me laughing, and then the rest of it is review. <laughs> but this is one of the series that is doing extremely well on my channel, even though it's mostly me laughing. So I'm glad that you guys enjoy me laughing <laughs> anyways guys let's hop into this episode oh yeah in the last episode that's right Adonella is a goddess who never do anything like to take a human's life but you know what Adonella can take my life oh yeah that's right she's been training mash and alulu oh shit i released one of his dragon metamorphosis seals by gaining a dragon hand his attack power has jumped several levels that's pretty crazy i mean that is a creepy hand <laughs> laughably large right hand <laughs> Why is he talking so slow? <laughs> yeah, is that her ability? To slow someone down? Delay, that's that's a dumb ability. <laughs> a dumb good ability. <laughs> He's talking like Henry. <laughs> so she can also speed him up. It's like she can control time. That's actually really good. But if he gets, if he could go that fast, he could train twice as hard at that speed. Don't tell me why is it bad that Mitis is teaching him how to use the bow? She is a terrifying goddess. More terrifying than Adonella. Yo, if she terrifying, then I'll be scared all the time. Adonella doesn't compare. She is a nymphomaniacal goddess. She abducts sexually devours. Sexually devours. That's why Ishtar drove her. Yo, she can sexually devour me. But I doubt Seiya will let that get to him. Seiya is not attracted to anyone besides Adonella. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I like how Mash is blushing. He's just like, ooh, this anime is a blessing, dude. <laughs> Rista's such a pervert. I love her, dude. She is the waifu of this season. Oh my! What the fuck is happening? What is happening? This episode's gonna be a mess. This will be your final test. Oh my god. You must volley of. Oh my god. What is this anime? It's so good! <laughs> the way Rista is acting is like a is like how usually male characters act in this. Oh my god! My libido is just back now saying bring me down with their sexual shooting. This anime is so good! He <laughs> shot her dad! Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> fucking say Oh! 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 <laughs> Look at Mash's face, dude. The truth is, if I felt like it, I could have escaped the. Oh my god. Oh no. I mean, yo, yes. Those eyebrows, though. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that is good. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Look, Mash is now frightened. I'm perfectly fine with a shota. What the? Run, Mash, run! No, actually, accept it, Mash. Accept it. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Being penetrated by... Oh, my God. <laughs> I love how Seiya is completely unfazed. Awful and vulgar goddess. Adonel is still better. Brave but dumb. <laughs> snipe. He's gonna snipe him. He thinks of everything. He's so cautious. The goddess scent. I want to smell it. <laughs> oh my god, what an idiot. <laughs> I thought this might happen. It is way within what I expected. <laughs> it is like his new saying. I expected this to happen. Ooh. <laughs> Say is such a bitch. Say to them, nice day, isn't it? Dude, say it with the fucking aim. Just fly, balloon woman! Fly! <laughs> Cause he's planning to just drop her and to kill her. Reverse firework. Dude, she's so dumb! Oh my god, Rosalie, you just fucked it up for everyone. But I bet you say is so overpowered, he probably could see all the way up there. It's like not even that far for him. <laughs> nice day, isn't it? <laughs> he's stalling! <laughs> it's all according to plan. 
Nice catch. Nice catch. He analyzes things just like say. I mean, he has like a billion eyes or whatever the fuck's they're called. <laughs> say yes, and he's ready perfectly. A seven shot shining arrow. Oh shit, he's straight dodging. I mean, this might be better for him so he could just. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. What? What? <laughs> That's right. They transformed into birds and came flying back. Okay. Jeez, it's so stupid. You know, honestly, even though that was like pretty amazing, nothing was more amazing than that fight against the goddess, dude. Is a man who clings to his cautiousness. Wait, why is his face like that? Boomerang, birdie, boom, boom. <laughs> Boomerang, birdie, boom, boom is so much longer. This bitch need to shut the fuck up. She needs to shut up. <laughs> he should have just let her get some reverse fireworks. Oh, he wants them to actually fight, but they're just cleaning up. Oh, shit. God damn. It's just like a machine gun. <laughs> they didn't even get to do anything. Why is he collecting them? <laughs> He's just making them do the cleaning duty. <laughs> what am I, a broom? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Don't say anything at all. Dude, she's annoying as fuck. But I bet you say it doesn't even need that shit. He's not even, he doesn't need that. Sacred legendary cursed armor. She needs to stop. She has to understand that she's a failure. <laughs> oh, fuck. What the hell is that? This is something I summoned up? He summoned that? Oh, shit. He's one of the heavenly kings. He, he defeated two. The legendary armor from the shrine. Dude, I bet you he could take on the demon lord now if he really, really wanted to. Man, fuck, fuck the armor. <laughs> He's been fine. Even he didn't even need the sword. Honestly, he say it's chilling right now. This episode had a lot of good stuff, if you know what I mean. I'm trying to figure out how to review this because, like I said, most of, most of this anime for me when I when I do content on it is mostly me laughing, giving my side commentary. Rosalie is annoying as fuck. I don't like Rosalie at all. I'm sure she has her reasons uh, why she doesn't like Seiya, why she feels like someone else is a true hero. She probably has the definition of a hero differently than other people. Everyone has their own definition of a hero, right? But I think, like, she's annoying. I don't... Say a deadass saved her life. She was all about chivalry when she was about to die. And Say a saved her life. She should have just... Oh my god, I don't know. I don't like Rosalie. Mitis, is that her name? She's... Oh my god. God, bro. I didn't expect any of that. I was wondering in the last live reaction why she seemed a little bit crazy and why she seemed a little bit off to me. And it kind of makes sense now. I got some thumbnail material. <laughs> it's just me screaming and I apologize for everyone's ears. I do apologize for what's going to come. I mean, after the fact. I mean, it is after the fact. I'm sorry. But I still think Adonella is obviously the better girl compared to Mrs. I actually, no, I like Adonella. She's just a sweet girl. This bitch crazy. Of course, she's a massive kiss i mean it reminds me of darkness but you know more crazier and she's a goddess and she can't die every fight that seiya goes through it's not even about the fight because we know seiya just honestly runs through everything that he fights like even this this heavenly king he's going to die he has no chance against defeating seiya even the demon lord i'm sure the demon lord's going to lose to seiya but obviously it's not about the fight it's about everything that happens around the fight the training portion the the road to getting that power because at this point he has surpassed the arrow goddess surpassed her she could sexually devour me though totally <laughs>